All right, so we've done kickboxing combination number one. Um, and that was the first tip. Now for second tip, we gotta work on kickboxing combination number two. All right, so it's very similar actually to one, but it teaches you the stepping with the jab that most people miss, okay, in doing jabs. So stand over here, please. So we're gonna step jab, right. Outside sweep, left hook, right round kick. That's the first part. Second part, jab, step jab, inside sweep, Cross, switch round kick. There you go. That's kickboxing combination number two. There's something really valuable about sweeps. That's the fighting stance, please. Doing sweeps, you're kicking to the inside low, but what it really does, like if I ever have to fight someone who's got a really strong right hand, you can't do anything about their hand, but if you take their front leg out, the hand will have no power. So that's one of the things, if you notice his upper body, so look what happens to his upper body. See, that got thrown off, right, for a second. That's the time I would hit, or try to pick this leg up in the air, not do a cross. It's got no power, right, when you're doing it. So that's why if you wanna take someone's right cross away, hurt their front leg. Either kick, leg kick them or, or sweeps. So we're gonna try this again. So step jab, outside sweep, left hook. So same time, notice that sweep? Yeah. So sweep, left, there you go. Then right away. So again, you're, you're sweeping, you're loading, you're unloading, right? You wanna get rid of, to get, get used to the whole idea of you're always loading and unloading moves. I'm gonna do that again. Step jab, outside sweep. Left hook, right round kick, good. Second part, back up please. Step jab, inside sweep, cross, Switch round kick. There you go. So that's kickboxing combination number two. Teaches you how to step with a jab and introduces you to the concept of low outside sweep and inside sweep.